This guy went outside Kenya looking for green pastures, but unfortunately he landed up in Saudi Arabia or somewhere in the Gulf, where she's now breastfeeding dogs. She left her children and her husband in Kenya after, having, uh, after two months of giving birth, and then when they realized that she's having, uh, she can breastfeed, the, the employer, instead of giving her uh, a, a proper job, uh, a, a, a proper job, he, he gave this girl a job of breastfeeding uh, his puppies in that particular area. This is what I've been saying, that this is indirect slavery. And I want to appeal to our government to go the way the first government of President Kibaki under Phils uh, Kandie as the Minister of Labor did, he banned all employment agents. She banned all employment agencies in Kenya, because let this issue of our people, migrant workers from Kenya, be a government to government. Let government of Kenya negotiate with the government of Saudi Arabia on terms and conditions of service, be it in Qatar or anywhere in the Middle East, so that our people living this country can do decent jobs. Not a job of priest feeding dogs. This is very dangerous to our own country. It denies the dignity of our own people. It denies respect of our own people. It denies us our own citizenship as Kenyans who are from a free and independent country, a country that practices democracy, a country that can attract both direct and indirect investment and create employment for our own people. I want to appeal the government of His Excellent President William Samuel Ruto to ban all employment agencies and review issues related to outside employment of this country as, uh, as, as it has been always advocated for by the International Labour Organization so that our people can have decent jobs there and we better We better, we better as Kenyans remain the way we are, but with our own respect and dignity. So I'm appealing to our government, again, that let us ban all these employment agencies. This is, this, these people, what they are trying to do with our young girls, young uh, daughters and sons, is indirect, applying indirect slavery. And when somebody goes outside there, she or he is a completely 100% slave. How can one's daughter be turned into a person, to an animal who is breastfeeding animals, dogs?